And what's remarkable about this value is it's very close to the real velocity of these marbles at the bottom. Now, it is gonna be a little bit different because in reality, there is some friction in the system. Friction causes some of the marble's energy to turn into heat, and that's energy being released from this system, which would result in a slightly lower velocity at the bottom, but it's really not much. And because it's such a low friction system and it's such a short distance, we can safely ignore the effects of friction, and we're still gonna get a very, very accurate number here. So what does this tell us? Well, all the marbles started with the exact same potential energy, which means they all should have ended with the exact same kinetic energy, which means they all should have the exact same velocity at the bottom of the ramp. So the answer to our initial question in this video is all the marbles have the same velocity down here. Despite the fact that the blue marble gets there first, it's still going to be moving with the same speed as all the others when they get to that position.